Before the night ends, before the night ends, switch up to the white bins. Thursday morning feels. Yep. <laughs> so he comes by Bobby's and Yeah, who the hell is that? Yeah. That was my mother. That was Montana, bless her heart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm back in that Ford F-150, ready to, ready to go hit the trails. Montana. I used to run up and down these roads all the time. Quick cardio sesh. I uh, just bumped into my cousin. Actually, we were running. He does uh, ships water up in the mountains for uh, fire season. So, yeah, bumped into him coincidentally. Welcome to Montana. So, we're in Montana. When we landed, it was sunny and it was cloudy. Now it's raining, but the sun's trying to come back out. The saying in Montana is if you don't like the weather, wait 15 minutes. <laughs> we start up at the uh, luxury five-star restaurant in Missoula, Montana. Uh, got a few, some of Cody's family here, as well as uh, I think some of my, a couple of mine are coming. My great grandma is coming home. So yeah. this is my great grandmother. She's turning 94, and uh, we're really excited to celebrate on that. Yeah. Cannabis and CBD space. Well, um, California is uh, a perfect place then. Yeah, I'm running a, a head fund out of uh, Canada. Is that Matthew? Yeah. Happy birthday to you. 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 Yo, it's Matthew Morgan, Missoula, Montana. Back <laughs> with the old fam. Just left my grandmother's 94th birthday. Couldn't be more excited to see everybody. Now heading to my cousin's house to smoke a little of the herbal remedy and see what he's, else he's got cultivating and cooking. Winter. Dude, I should get Montana made fucking tattooed on my ass. You really? <laughs> <laughs> they, cause, made. Cause, like, they have these stickers that say Montana made that yeah. are very like distinct. Yes, of course. And I'd get that exact stamp on my ass. <laughs> Harrison lost his jewel. I mean, losing your jewel is the absolute worst feeling. Absolute worst feeling in the world. He's literally depressed. Look at him. Would you lose his jewel? Just that little stupid e-cig thing. <laughs> Did you ever smoke the shit that we used to call the crazy? <laughs> yeah. That was oil. Really? Yeah. It was dipped in oil. It was the straight, it was straight oil. And we called it the crazy. And we did, I bought this house in 2012. And we were doing it in my basement. <coughs> Alright, we invented the fucking dab and here's why. <laughs> you we used to buy boatloads of hash from these fucking old weirdos. Hippies. Okay, hippies, call them what you want. And we'd buy these bulk things of hash, and we would fucking stick. You'd take a two-liter pop bottle, cut the bottom out so it was, so you could fucking suck through it, right? And then we'd stick the butter knives into a hot stove and get them red, scalding hot, 
and we take little pieces of hash and line them up on the counter. Remember that shit? And we tap and, it, and you tap one of the hot stick. fucking knives to it. That, that, that hash would instantly glue to the knife. You put it under the two liter bottle. Someone else would be having the knives. You stick the other hot knife to the other hot knife, and it smashed that hash, and it would just create a plume of smoke. Fun. And it, you just suck this huge plume of hash smoke up and just cough for 45 minutes. High school high every time. Yeah, I feel like that was the first dab. And then what happened? Dude, we giggled and laughed we like six hours. We ended up the crazy because that's yeah. how fucking high you yeah. were. <laughs> that, that, that is so yeah, true. so we had a tube like We this. nicknamed it the crazy because we, no one knew what a dab was. about to drive by the old house that I grew up in from zero to 18 years old. Uh, it's a single family house. It's right there, actually. Well, back at that old house we just drove by, I used to watch uh, episodes of Entourage in the basement, which now is my life. And now it kind of is, so manifest that shit. Uh, my mother has a 5,000 square foot house out on five acres. Horses, the whole nine yards. Living that American dream. How's it going, this hog? We're going road tripping. Nice car. Thanks, homie. Look at the rims on this thing. Gosh. I got my Tamagotchis in the back. All my stuffed animals, I keep those fresh in the back. <laughs> Up, she keeps going. <laughs> Two flat tires, the truck's right up, Yo, she keeps going. Yeah, yeah. Hey, I'll see you guys to the next destination. I'll keep this thing cherry. Stay blessed. <laughs> We're going to Flathead Lake. Get in or, or get out. Oh, you in or you out? We've been best friends since we were six. I'm never going back. 